guys, I want to share with you the amazing results that we got from our little mini greenhouse that LP built around those 12 tomato plants that he planted. This is our first one on November the 3rd. Well, folks, it's supposed to get down to 15 degrees tonight. I took and put this bubble wrap up and uh, taped it and everything, and I got a little ceramic heater going here, and I got a couple heat lights back here. But when it gets down to 15, I don't think it's gonna, going to uh, keep it from freezing in here. And uh, so I'm going to have to pick these t bigger tomatoes and uh, take them in and ripen them in the house. Uh, it's just a, a just, shame. Just look at these beautiful tomatoes. They are gonna make it, guys. I'm going to leave some wee little ones on there. So we're going to pick these tomatoes and uh, see how they make it, see if the plants can make it through the night. These tomato plants, guys, were planted the end of July, which is uh, really late to plant them, but he, but LP didn't get to them uh, early enough, and so he went ahead and planted them, and this is a swampy area, so he used, like, he built up the soil around each plant, and you can see these wooden boxes uh, around the plants, uh, so he added soil uh, more soil to them, and uh, we got three and a half bushel altogether. He got as much as um, oh a half a bushel probably or more uh, from some of the plants from from just one plant uh, on some of them, and uh, they they were really some beautiful tomatoes and. Um, we gave them to like 10 people. I made tomato juice. We had them for eating. Um, we still have some for eating. And this is um, December the 6th. And we still have some green ones left. Uh, so uh, we've really been blessed with having tomatoes. We had them uh, through the summer, of course, outside. So um, here is... Uh, this is how much he was picking off of one plant, and he wasn't quite done picking whenever I filmed. So um, anyhow, guys, it, it, it is just really, um, uh, you know, a wonderful thing when you can grow some of your own food. Now, they're not quite as good when they're in the greenhouse, but still, it's just nice. I mean, this was like, I say, a little mini greenhouse, so it didn't get the sun but they were still good, guys, even though they had to ripen inside. 